intro! Hey, okay, so I don't really have too much time to vlog right now, but we're gonna have over some company. Um, it's my mom's friend, who she w used to work with, who usually lives in Belgium. And, um, he's in America right now, so they've been hanging out for a little, for uh, the past two days. And they went to an art museum this morning. <laughs> I guess that's <laughs> fun quality times going to an art museum. I don't know. Um, so they're ooh. so he's coming over for dinner, and we just got home. But then she called and she was like, "We're coming home in a half an hour." And this morning before she left, she was like, "You have to ha clean um, the table up before we go." To we go come. To oh, he might. I don't know, so I don't really know what's happening, but um, <laughs> we were like speed cleaning, and I'm sort of eating lunch at the same time, but that's what's happening, and if anything interesting happens, I'll show you. I don't know if I should introduce you to him. I don't really know him. <laughs> I mean, I met him when I was like three, um, haven't seen him since, and so I have no idea practically who he is, so I'm not really sure, um, but I'll let you know and stuff. I have an orchid uh, expert. I began to hear today. Well, for the last few weeks, I think it's still on. Well, we'll see what we get into. I hope it is. I love orchids. They're my favorite. Well, there's all kinds of orchids, eh? pretty. Those are all orchids. This is a lovely orchid display and then there's the big trees. Oh, I love it here so much. Everything's so pretty. So you do have your other tools. You need a case. For what, that? Yeah. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. um, look at this. Huh. Yellow bamboo. Hehe. they took away the rabbit. Yeah, I know. <laughs> tree in here. Wait, where'd the other one go? There it is. <laughs> and there's one that's just ripe. Pretty. <laughs> Literally trees of orchids. What? Oh my gosh. So beautiful. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> This view. <sighs> That's quite nice. Yeah, I wish the focus was better on this, but there's some pink flowers in the distance that make it all so pretty. And then there's a waterfall. Oh, it's too pretty. Even more orchids. These are like, they look like they're 3D, but they're actually like flat. Like this is all flat in here, which is really neat. And these aren't. These are very 3D and very beautiful. Oh. Erect sword ferns. LOL. I'm just not understanding these orchid trees. Oh, okay, wait, it says. It says each column is filled with 500 uh, something orchids. To ensure proper watering throughout the display, gardeners run an indigenous irrigation tube system through the metal framework to each and every plant. So it's really like a column with metal framework, if you can see it, which is still really neat, though. Very artistic. And I love the vines on the walls, like everywhere. And we've got the big orchids, the big mamas. These are the ones that smell nice, and oh, they're so pretty, and I just love them so much. So, 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 so much. My favorite flower is orchids, like, without a doubt. Definitely my favorite flower is orchids, and they're having an orchid display right now, which is so cool. Really gorgeous big ones. This is so pretty, this whole display. Ugh. 
I love this. Some brown orchids, which are interesting. They're kind of, I guess, purplish in a way, but mostly brown. But they're beautiful. These are so pretty. Hmm. Whole house of orchids. This part it's so pretty at night because it's lit up and the orchids just have oh like all this light on them and it's right now it's sunlight which is really nice but it's also like messing with the camera welcome to the rainforest section and here we have some welcome massive palm trees some really hot climate um, and some really just neat looking trees what are those I don't even know and there's a banana tree somewhere and then on the floor, it's just like layers upon layers of just plants everywhere. <laughs> oh, these are really cool. I don't know what they are. I should say, but I don't know which one it is. Huh. Oh wait, that one says, okay, so something plum. I don't know. One of these is banana, but I forget. It's not that. Which one's the banana, Mom? Oh, that's a cool sight. It's a really cool shot. Oh, and there was a drop and I stumbled. Mom, you should definitely get my picture here. This would be a cool one. Bonsais. Bonsai. Bonsai. What? Bonsai. Why? Remember that? No. Oh, wait, I'm remembering it, but I forget. What was it again? No, but I think the bonsai would be here too. Yeah. Oh, they're so cool. They just look so much like real trees. It's so weird. They're like miniature, I don't know, miniature realities. Like the detail. And I know they're real trees, but just miniature, but like still, the way they look like big trees, but they're not, it's unbelievable. Dad, what was the bonsai joke? I forget. The guy was showing his family through and she would say, oh, bonsai. He said, bonsai. Bon he must have said it 50 times. I was ready to smack him over. I don't, I don't remember. Enough, enough. enough of the bonsai. Bonsai. Whole colony there. <laughs> look at this. Oh yeah. They look so realistic. Ah. They're alive. Well, right? I mean, like, you know what I mean? It's like a forest. Yeah, it's like a big forest, but miniature. <laughs> Very fast. <laughs> easy to maintain. <laughs> yeah. No, they're not easy to maintain. Oh my gosh, they're so fragile. Oh, white bounce. This is pretty. Are you going in here? Yeah. Oh, it smells so good in here. <laughs> oh my gosh, it smells amazing. And oh, look how pretty this is. It's hard to tell. There's too much glare on the camera. There we go. Oh my gosh, it smells like heaven. That one apple tree we bought, Jack, they were supposed to, it was supposed to grow Yeah, like it will. Yeah, it was supposed to. There's little blossoms on it. I know you can't see it from the white balance, but it's gorgeous. These are really pretty. And they look like, almost like little faces or little butterflies. Are these, um, kum kumquats? Yeah. Kumquats are tasty. Now, am I wrong when I say you eat the whole thing? I have no idea. I don't think I've ever eaten a kumquat. I used to eat them all the time, and I ate them with a friend of mine who I think didn't like me very much in reality, and she used to tell me to eat the whole thing. And it tasted really good, but it was bitter and weird. What's this? Hong Kong kumquat. That's really cool. See? Not kidding. And long grass. It's real. Oh, man, I miss summer. This is making me miss summer. Ooh. Look at the roots of that. Citrus hybrid. It's got like some sort of kumquatish, orangish thing growing on it, and these are just more kumquats. No? 
blogging? I'm kind of blogging. Just a little. Just a little. Lemon. Did you know lemons grow like that? I didn't. I didn't think they were green when they were growing. It's cool. More comfortable. Spotted orchids. Of a glass wall. No, they have. Only long with garden. Yeah, <laughs> oh, that's cool. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> in the summer, isn't this like covered something in roses? Something smells. Yeah, something smells. Mm -hmm. Ah, oh, the fuzzy, flowery things. I, so cool. <laughs> Looks a lot more majestic in reality. Oh, and then there's these hanging vine things. That's like, yeah, now you have the illusion of having them brush your head. Some more orchids. Apologies to any guys watching this vlog. It's obviously very, well, I guess not girly, but sort of. Big green leaf. <laughs> Those are cool. They like bright bluish green. I don't know. And there's like, wait, look at this. <laughs> this, is so, this is so weird. That's really funny. Oh my gosh. 
Yeah, how old does this say this? This is a really old tree and he's on supports. Crutches, as my mom says. <laughs> how? They don't have the old sign. They don't say how old it is? They used to have the sign, now you gotta have the... You know that there's doing those things that you have or to read. Okay, guys, phone, man. Man. guys, go scan that. <laughs> dial, dial it on your phone. I can't. It's your phone, I think. Talk in the morning. <laughs> she got to talk. <laughs> we don't. Such a cool tower. <laughs> but yeah. See what bird that is around over there. It's not even a deep lake, and I used to think it was so cool, no. but nope. Well, they it's put like... ice in it sometimes in the winter. Oh, do they really? Wasn't that cold this year? That's unfortunate. Yeah. <laughs> I was making fun because I talk so much. I was saying how this was like the coolest part of the whole park or garden when I was um, younger. I used to think this was just the coolest thing because this is usually filled with water. And then there's this tower and we used to be able to walk up into it. And it was so cool. I would have like dreams that I was a princess in the tower and I would come into the lake and be rescued from alligators. Like I would have the most elaborate dreams about this place. See if we can run up it all like 250 steps or something like that. We counted them once. Oh, and then there's the waterfall all the way back there, but none of the water's on. Let's see if we can walk. <laughs> it's hard to tell. Oh, that's not a pathway. But yeah, we used to be able to walk up it, and this was all water, and there's the waterfall in the back, and oh, so cool. Tell me this isn't a really cool tower. It's like Rapunzel or something. It's totally open. We could walk inside there if we wanted to, all the way up, but I don't think we're going to, but... Yeah, you can! It's open! The stairs are all open! Yeah, really, really, really neat. That's where the waterfall runs down. You can't see it too clear, but it's just a bunch of rocks, and it's so cool. Except that on a Carillon, they are much bigger, and they are all a natural maple color. Each baton or controls one bell clamor. Can you Here. see the bells? Yeah, I see. Music, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dad. <laughs> I played the I played the bell. And there they are up there. Huh. You can only sort of see. Just looks like Sorry. you're fine. Looks like something out of a fairy tale. Anymore. And this is where the waterfall usually comes yep, through. That's where it comes, down. comes down there, under here, and over there. Like a bajillion little, what are they again? Crocuses? Oh, yeah, very much. And there's a squirrel hopping around over there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hop, hop, hop. <laughs> Wall of Thorns, eerily reminiscent of the tale of Sleeping Beauty, if you read the actual fairy tale by Hans Christian Andersen. <sighs> Topiaries, by the way. <laughs> Can you see them? Oh. Yep. There's like a whole world under these big trees. And then look, you can't even see if I back up enough. It's just a big tree. And it's got Paul's favorite, the tiny pine cones. <laughs> tiny pine cones. But yeah, it's like a whole big world in there. It's so neat. Oh wow, that is a blurry goose. There we go. Hi, goose. He's coming over because he thinks I'm going to feed him something. Yeah, I know. He's so close. Oh, he's trying to eat the fish. Oh, his little tongue. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, come here, baby. Here, Goosey. Look at all the fish, you guys. You probably can't see them. Oh, hello. You're just sauntering right over to me. I didn't even see you. You're kind of scary. You're like right next to me. I don't know if you can see it. He's like pretty close. No zoom on this. Hi, can I pet you? Mom, can I pet the goose? <laughs> no. And germs. I'm more worried about its teeth, which they have. 
Go on, flop into the water. That'd be cute. Show the vlog your stuff. That one just pooped all over everything. That's gross. I don't want to come. <laughs> Hi. I am right next to this thing. I am kind of scared because the ones at my house are kind of hostile. That's my foot. That's it. Hi. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go now before I get in trouble. Oh, I'm not going to kick you or anything, I promise. Oh my gosh, they're so flexible. Okay. Got it. The other? It's like a little island. Well, I may or may not have pushed half of him in the pond the other day. Well, you know what? He was um, biting at his, his, um, yeah. his paw, too. So I don't know if he was... Like, I present to you the world's giantest treehouse. Maybe not ever, but one of them, certainly. It's pretty tall. It's pretty awesome inside. There's like windows. I think there's like electric lighting. It's pretty cool. But they trim them. Yeah. These trees are so cool looking. Yeah, they're definitely cut. Yep. That's what it's supposed to look like. Yeah. And these are the Italian gardens, minus the fountains that are always flowing. Well, Those are all fountains on the side, and in the middle, these are all lakes and like not lakes, but like little bodies of water. And really gorgeous. It's a nice touch. It really is. Isn't that usually with water flowing down it? Those. Yeah. yeah. No, no, no. Over there. Over. That has the water coming down. This is just. This nice. one doesn't. No. So you get down there and you look. Oh, that has the yeah, water that one. Okay, I see it now. This one doesn't have a ridge on the end, on the edge. All right, so we can. Just tried to vlog and took a picture of myself by accident. Awesome! It's from all the. the mm. Anyway, um, I didn't ever vlog Christian, but I think you might have saw him in the background a couple times. But he left to go home and. I'm just sitting at home and I finally finished all my homework, so I'm editing that big two-part vlog because I never did it yesterday. Eh. Um, but like, just to explain that, I know you're seeing this after they're already up, but to explain what that is, um, I had a lot, a lot, a lot of footage, as in 42 clips total from the 24th and the 25th. And because I've been like crazy editing recently, I was just like, I really don't want to go through the trouble of making like a big huge vlog for the 24th and the 25th. So what I'm going to do is I split them up and the first one, which will like be the 24th sort of, it they'll both go up under two part 24 slash 25th. Um, but the first one is going to be like about Schnitzelfest and about like the arts at the art show that we went to. Um, and then the second one is going to be all the footage I took with my friends at those two different places and what footage I took the next day when I was vlogging. So that's why they're all different um, because I feel like it'd be good to break them up. And I just organized the clips into those two different folders and I still have a lot of editing to do with those because um, I didn't use a lot of clips. A lot of clips were loud. Um, I was with friends and it, lots of editing to do. So I'm going to do that now though. And um, that's about it. I had a really fun day and lots of footage today too. I feel like Vlogging's been a lot more quality recently, <laughs> except for the ones that turn out to be like a minute. Mm. But that's okay. I mean, lazy vlogs are necessary sometimes. But yeah, that's a thing, and I just wanted to explain that to you before vlogging, or <laughs> yep, before editing. And I'm gonna go do that now. This is pathetic. Even you know what? What splitting up the two days? bits, one ends up being like, I don't know, um, I don't think it says here. The, the first part, the one that's just the arts, which I thought was long, like 15 minutes-ish, 12 I think, 13? Part 2, with all my friends in it, like 30 minutes. What the butt? This is not good. <laughs> I split it up for a reason. Ooh. I don't know. I apologize if anybody actually watches that whole thing. Good on them. But the whole thing's really funny. At least it is for me, who's like, I'm friends with them, so maybe it's not funny to anybody watching, but I thought it was pretty hilarious, so I'll leave you to decide that. But the Oscars are on, and they're pretty darn good, so I'm done editing. Thank goodness. I've edited everything up to today, and all, all I have to do is process and upload. Oh my gosh, that took forever. <laughs> It took so long, but it's done now. Thank God. I hate having things pile up. But I think I'm just going to go to bed early. <laughs> Actually, not early. It's already 10, but detail shmi tales. And, um, yeah, so I'm going to do that thing where I say goodnight. I think. <laughs>